Hello, and welcome to this series of Cisco email security updates. This video will share information and an overview of cloud URL analysis that is available starting with AsyncOS 13.5. Email today is a prime target for phishing, malware, and additional methods of attacks aimed at unsuspecting end users via URLs. URLs embedded in emails and attachments come in many forms. Normal URL, shortened URLs, and manipulated URLs are just a few examples. We know that the delivery of timely web intelligence to the field requires systems to rapidly spread content to Cisco devices around the world, as well as systems to produce detection content that is relevant for our customers. Today, our existing email web intelligence systems have challenges delivering new information quickly, while our detection systems have challenges in processing and coordinating decisions across multiple systems. Cisco's position as a leader in security affords us the opportunity to leverage the breadth of our product portfolio and the depth of the data these systems produce to cover more threats than our competitors can. As the threat landscape constantly shifts, we need to respond by researching and integrating new kinds of analysis without significantly increasing operational load. Cisco Email Security and Cisco Talos designed cloud URL analysis to address both concerns via a new intelligence delivery mechanism and a modern analysis framework. When a customer's ESA receives an email that triggers outbreak filters, URLs associated with that email are routed to CUA for out-of-band analysis, where the URL is passed through an escalating level of intelligence generation. At the end of this process, if there's enough information to positively affirm the URL contains a threat, the URL is added to Talus's intelligence database and subsequent reputation lookups from the field will receive this new intelligence. Cloud URL analysis uses service logs generated from customers for telemetry to identify URLs which are good candidates for additional screening. Cloud URL analysis convicts a URL by first collecting information about it, then evaluating if the collective intelligence warrants an action being taken. Making this determination can be complex and depends on the type of threat. If a threat actor is reusing a template or past campaigns, CUA can convict a matching URL without needing to crawl its content. Other content may need to be fetched and have its contents examined. The information and microservices that make up Talos's analysis dataset will then be triggered. Talos is constantly evaluating the efficacy of the existing detection logic and adjusting this as threats change and new research comes online. CUA focuses on positively identifying threats with high confidence. This allows us to prosecute detected URLs more aggressively, but it also means that not all URLs threats may meet this high bar. There can be a variety of reasons that a threat URL is not convicted, such as the web page is no longer online when it is analyzed, or attackers are adjusting their techniques to avoid detection. Talos actively adjusts CUA to catch as many things as we can while maintaining the overall balance of detection versus false positives. CUA is a new system launched with Async OS 13.5. It can detect certain types of threats today, but more capabilities are being added regularly. As CUA is an updated and enhanced, the Cisco Email Security Administrator does not need to be concerned with updating on-box engines or upgrading async OS to get the latest CUA release. All of this is handled from the cloud side, requiring no action from the administrator. Cloud URL analysis provides reduced latency with URL detections and results. It also focuses to reduce platform dependency and administration overhead. And finally, CUA is designed to aggregate global ESA service logs helping to build and deliver a robust method of stopping malicious URLs. For more information on new items with our 13.5 and 13.51 release, please see our release notes and user guide. I hope you enjoyed this short video. Thanks for watching.